Okay, this is part two of the purse dory, as we're calling it. And I'm just trimming it with ribbon. And once I get the ribbon around, then I'll go in and I'll touch up these little folds and make them look all pretty. Of course, I want to do this one now because it's bugging me. I'm just going to take it around and let me see if I glue. Did I put glue down here? I don't think I put glue down here, so I'm going to have to put glue there. Okay. So I'm just going around. Like I said, I'll neaten it up after I get, get myself around the block here. But yes, you can, we were talking earlier, you can line this like a typical lining, you know, how you would wrap your outside over and then put your lining down. Um, you could certainly do that. I kind of went with in this direction because I wanted it to look like a purse. And I thought, well, they use pretty trims in a purse, so I thought I would do it this way. And I'm just cutting the ribbon right when I get to that eyelet, and I'm just going to keep going. Does anybody have a birthday in the house? Oh, yeah, I wanted to do the giveaway. You want to do the giveaway? Yeah, that's what we said. Okay. That's good. Well, I can let this dry. It doesn't hurt to let things dry. Okay. So for the giveaway, I have one of my favorite books of all time, which I hope everybody doesn't have it. I'm hoping some people don't have it. Um, but if you haven't read it, you really need to read it. It's so good. Um, I, get a, I don't want glue to get on it. Okay, so. And it's Pam Carricker, Art at the Speed of Life, Mixed Media Art Every Day. So I'm giving this away. I have, I have it. I love it. Um, it has all different kinds of techniques, interviews with other artists about how they schedule their day and how they build in time for their art. And then um, I'm giving away one of Seth's stencils. This is one of the ones I used from Stencil Girl. This isn't the physical one I used, but you know what I mean. <laughs> so. Let me get the, uh, yeah, it's really good. Bye, Ange! Let's go, um, let's get the bingo thing. Okay. I'm not gonna be able to like stop chat or anything. Well, maybe you guys could watch. So it's a number between one and 70 for mine. So, pick a number between one. Now, what do I say? I say go and all that, right? Okay, so the rules are... You have to type in go. I will type or in go. After I say go, you type in a number. The closest, one number only, the closest one that does not go over 70 wins. One book you don't have. Oh my gosh, it's so good. Okay. I mean, if you win it, you'd have a nice Christmas present to give to somebody, like me, because <laughs> I don't have it. <laughs> you don't have it? Ooh, my own sister doesn't have that book, and I'm giving it away? That's bad news. I know. <laughs> okay, I'm getting ready to say go. I'm just going to wait in case there's a lag. I still have to read hashtag. Go. Whoa. <laughs> hey Lilith, just trying to say hi to people I haven't said hi to. I know I did. Now you see hey. all the people that are in I here because I Kathy, I, CB Licia. Should be CB Licious. Mindy, Lilith, Sandy Chica. Shlarmak. Carrie? I didn't even say hi to Carrie. That's terrible. Hi, Carrie. Love you. Love, love. Upside down heart. <laughs> okay, I guess we're done. All right, enough boomerang. Let me get my number. Let me get my number. 
Okay, give it like 10 more seconds because there's a lag and Kathy just put her number in. Oh, okay. I just want to announce it. Okay, now type in stop. That way. S-T-O-P. Stop. Okay, the number is 8. B8. 8. 8. Did I see any low number? No. Everybody was over. Everyone's over? Okay, we'll do it again. That's the fear. Can somebody, can, you, can somebody check to make sure it looks, it appears that, I don't know how the social stream works on, on a tablet if you get everybody, if you get everybody typing stuff in, if you see the whole chat. Just check if somebody could check and see if there's anybody that has eight or under, but I don't think I saw anybody. Okay, well, nope. that's okay, well you can keep your original numbers. I'm just going to roll again. Oh, N45, N45. Oh, somebody got 45. Oh, um, be bliss. Cool. I'm sure she was the first one to have See, Blisha. Okay, if you could email Scrappy Camper Sisters at gmail.com with your address. I'm going to the post office on Tuesday. I owe people stuff and I'm mailing it all out. I got the day off so nobody could bug me, which is what happens when I go to the post office. <laughs> Okay. All right. That's Good awesome. For Good for you. Yeah. So just, um, and Cindy, if you already have this book, um, I'll send you my address in case you want to send me a Christmas <gasps> present. Oh. Cindy, do you have this book? You're going to love that. Do you do stencils? You're going to love that stencil. Cause I'm telling you what, you can't even get a bad, you can't get anything. You can't get a bad thing out of that stencil. Cool. Okay. That's awesome. So you're giving away the one that said unfinished? Yeah. It said, uh, no, it says discovery. Oh, this is the never again. Ooh. Discovery Look, safe. What? Never again. Open, begin, closed. Fear. Never fear again. Ooh, that's cool. Love that. You're welcome. You're welcome. Enjoy it. Enjoy it. It's fun. It's going to be fun. I'm Is that really... one of his new stencils? I think it's in the middle. Oh, okay. I don't have that one. It's, yeah, it's one. Of, I think it was his last release. I because I, that book. Cause I got the new ones and I can't find them. <laughs> I think that's going to be a really good book to read while you're doing the come clean this year because it kind of goes along you know. Yeah, I love this book. What I love about this book, and like I said, I have it. I'm, I'm not giving you mine. <laughs> that sounded rude, huh? But I mean, um, she's got a lot of techniques, and then she's got a lot of interviews about how people get their inspiration and how they schedule their work. Oh, good. She said she loves the stencil and keeps meaning to try and get it. Good, good, good. Yeah, that was fun doing that. I'm going to do that again. So I don't want to show the whole thing, but um, talking about, you know, the life of being an artist. She's got stuff in here on beeswax, collage, and some different um, seven-day journal. I just love this book. Photo collage. I thought that was really cool. Yeah, and about how artists, you know, how they make time for their art, which I thought was just really awesome. She also has another book. Well, she has several, but this is Pam Carricker. But she also has a 30-day one, a 30-day kind of art at the speed of, of life. Oh, her paints are awesome. Cool. Well, okay. So I guess I have to get back to my ribbon, huh? Ribbon. Kind of 
poking down my poking down the glue. Yay. Okay. So are you going to start recording and finishing your <gasps> I did that whole thing without re No, it's recording. Oh, you've recorded that part. Okay. Yeah. Of course I recorded the giveaway. Oh my gosh, you freaked me out. Can you stop the recording and start it over for the end of the first story? Oh, for crying out loud. Really? Sorry. Why? So that I don't have to edit the video to get it on YouTube. <sighs> All right. I'm whining. Make my life a little bit easier. Hang on. I don't see why we would have to edit it. Hang on. <laughs> 